Welcome to Stone Magpie. My name is Suzanne and today I've got an unboxing for you from a company I've not used before. In the box we've got a diamond painting from Carrot Dot Art and I'm looking forward to opening it and showing you the whole kit and discovering this company together. Right, let's get the box open. It's come in a nice sturdy box, so hopefully we don't have any creasing. Ooh. Let's get this one out. Look how well packaged this is. It's in a bigger box, I know, but it's got the protective cardboard wrapping and the box is sat beautifully inside and there are absolutely no creases, dings or anything on this box. Let the pleasure begin. Oh, I do like that. Piece by piece, just you and your masterpiece. How lovely. <laughs> oh, it's a lovely box. A really good quality feel to this box. On the side of the box, we have instructions. So if you wanted to buy a kit as a gift, it is all clearly explained how to diamond paint, what you need to do. So lovely box there. I'm impressed with that. Let's open it up. Ooh, I nearly gave away what's in the kit. Let's open it this end. <laughs> I don't want to give you any spoilers at this point. Ooh, so inside the box, you can see nicely nestling is the diamond painting itself. So you can see it's in a nice protective plastic sleeve, which we can easily open and take out. And let's finally see the image that I chose as my first diamond painting from them. I think already you can see how colourful this one is. Oh my goodness, she is absolutely beautiful. Look at the colours. Now I am getting a bit of reflection from my windows, so I'm going to turn this around. That's better. We can now see this beautiful image. Look at the lovely background with the yellow and the red bringing out the foreground of the image of this lovely, beautiful girl with feathers in her hair, the peacock feather, the symbolism around her neck. It's just lovely. And this one is called Spirit of Nature. And the artist is Aris. HB, I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. And here we've got the image in the corner as well. It, when I saw this, we're looking at the website, first of all, there are lots of images I hadn't seen before and this was one of them. And that is because the artist is exclusive to carrot.art. So if you go to their website, you are likely to see images you've not seen before. So that was a real draw for me. They do have the standard ones as well. Um, so you have a lot of choice on there and it is from Germany. So shipping to me didn't take that long at all. Within a week, it was here. So looking at this itself with the gorgeous feathers in all different colors, but look, some of them have got the details in them. We've got a beautiful peacock feather down this side. We've got what looks like a dream catcher type earring, both sides. We've got the feathers up in the top. We've got a feather here. We've got the beaded necklace with the lovely image of the pendant. And then looking at her face, we've got the headband. We've got those beautiful eyes staring out at the canvas at us. We've got the gorgeous painted facial features and then those luscious lips in the middle. It really is a striking image and it's so beautifully coloured. 
it looks like there's some really nice blending down into her neck here. Looking a bit closer at the image, the top half has a lot of colour blocking, as you can imagine with the background of that red and yellow, but also these feathers have a lot of colour blocking, as does her face. And then down each side of the hair, it becomes less colour blocked, but again, not too confetti heavy. The bottom half of the picture, again, colour blocking down the middle and less so on the outside. But again, I don't think this is too onerous in confetti. You can see there are blocks of colour everywhere, especially in the streaks of her hair. So I wouldn't say this is one that is going to be really confetti heavy. For those of you that don't like confetti, I think this could be a good choice for you because it keeps the interest rather than being solid colour blocking everywhere. And you could take breaks from either. So you could do some of the background colour blocked and then move into the busiest areas. And then when you get a little bit fed up of that, you can go back to the colour blocking, for example. Depends on how you like to work. This one has a bit of both. The eagle-eyed among you will notice that the legend shows 68 colours in this kit. So let's have a closer look at the symbols and the canvas itself. Here is the image at the top and the canvas has a scalloped edge with the perforations to stop the fraying and it has a little bit of a sparkle within the canvas. It has got the softer backing. However, you may well have noticed on the side here, it has got a crease in it, which I'm surprised at because the box was so sturdy. Perhaps that's happened when it's been put into the plastic protective cover. It's not an issue, it will come out. The picture itself has no creasing in it. Let's pull back this protective layer and have a look. There we go. Oh my goodness. Just pulling that back just makes those colours zing even more. I love colour, as you know, if you watch my channel regularly. And this is just full of beauty. The title of this canvas is Spirit of Nature. And I can see exactly why with all of the colours from nature in, within this picture. The glue itself is very glossy and very sticky. Let's do the same with the bottom. Absolutely no creases whatsoever in this canvas. It is just literally down this side. Oh, wow. Look at that. It is, it's just beautiful. Okay, we'll pop the protective layer back and we'll have a look at the legend. Looking at the legend, We've got a legend both right side and left side and we've got the picture here and then we've got the number, the symbol and the DMC number and as we run down you can see that we've got 1 to 8, a symbol 1 to 8 and then it goes randomly symbols and capital letters thereon. The dark colours have the white symbols and the paler colours have the black symbols. So we'll scroll through all the way down to number 68. And as you can see, these bottom numbers here are all ABs. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight ABs in this kit. How beautiful. <gasps> we will have a look at those. Um, so let's see what else is included in the kit. We get a sticker sheet for our kitting up. 
with a beautiful sticker of the image and then each number has been pre-cut for easy kitting up there. So that's, that's nice to have. And actually looking at this, there's lots left over here. So I would keep that and use for a different kit. <laughs> If you're a crafter, you know that you keep bits and bobs to use at another time. <laughs> so, nice to have the pre-cut stickers. Oh, now, interestingly, I have some washi tape here, which is branded. Let me find the end here. So we get some washi tape. However, I can't find a tool kit. I definitely don't have a tool kit. So, right, I'm going to have to go back to carrot.art and let them know that I didn't receive a tool kit. Following the unboxing, I contacted carrot.art to let them know that the tool kit was missing from the kit. And this is the response that I got from Mila. Hi Suzanne, thanks for your message. The tool kit has not been forgotten. Since this production, our artist motifs have been sent without tool kits, as most customers who buy an artist diamond painting from us are already experienced diamond painters who have no need for further tool kits. If we include them as standard in the set and the box is shrink wrapped to protect the contents, it is unfortunately no longer possible for us to remove the toolkits individually at the customer's request. Then resources would be wasted unnecessarily for their production and we would like to avoid this in future for environmental reasons. In addition, we can also reduce the costs for our customers a little because those who do not need another toolkit should of course not pay for it. Therefore, we have now deducted the amount of the toolkit from the basic price so that only those who want it can now order it and then also pay for it. The information whether an artist's diamond painting is sold with or without a toolkit can be found directly with the article where the drill shape, the canvas size and the number of colours and AB colours are also listed. Due to our decision not to waste resources unnecessarily, we have also decided to use up the boxes that have already been produced, even though the toolkit is unfortunately still listed with the contents. All this for your information. If you overlook the fact that you need to order the toolkit in addition and would now like to have one, we can send it to you. Please let us know. Best regards. So there we have it. Toolkits are not sent as standard with carrot.art and I'm okay with that. I understand that with the environmental impact and I actually agree that usually we don't need the toolkits that are sent to us as experienced diamond painters. So I had a look on the website and the toolkit is available separately for €2.99 and therefore if you wanted a toolkit you would need to remember to order it. I have had a look at the listing and it did actually say without toolkit quite clearly and I just missed that detail. So looking at their website, here is the picture and all of the details and I missed this detail here without toolkit. So scrolling down, you'll be able to see the toolkit here and there's the price, €2.99. Euros. So if you do want a toolkit, you can add it to the order and then it adds it onto the price as an extra item. Right, let's have a look at the diamonds. We've got self-seal baggies, which is lovely to have all of the colours in the baggies. I do prefer that. And I am immediately drawn to these colours here. Oh, aren't they fabulous? Really juicy, it's like um, fruity colours here. Spirit of Nature, remember, that's the name of this, this painting. Let's have a closer look. So, as you can imagine, ooh, really, really pretty colours in this kit. 
and I am going to open a bag, probably of the three tens, to have a closer look at. I like to do that with the darker colours because the darker colours I find can be quite dusty. So we're going to have a look and see. But oh, look, they're so pretty. Such pretty colours in this kit. Not forgetting eight ABs, remember, which I haven't found in this pack. So let's have a quick look at these before we look at the next pack. I'll go and get a diamond tray. Luckily, I have plenty, so we can have a look. And the reason I like these self-seal bags is because if you didn't want to kit up into a storage box, you can actually use them out of these bags. Honestly, with 68 colours, I would kit up this one um, into the Tic Tac or into my Elizabeth Ward-like storage. However, if you didn't want to, you don't have to when they're in the self-seal. So here we are, no dust at all, no static. Sparkling. Some of them are not lining up properly. Now remember, I am very, very fussy about my diamonds and I'm just going to get some tweezers and show you. Here we are, I've got some tweezers and I want to point out this diamond here because it's got like extra bits on the side so it won't sit straight. Now, it looks like the majority of them are, and we can expect to have junk in our diamonds. So it's not too bad, but I would discard that one. There's another one. So it will be interesting when I complete this kit how much junk we have, but the diamonds do look good. With squares, it's important that they sit together really nice next to each other. I've not done a diamond painting from Carrot Dot Art before, so I'm not sure how tight their grid is on the canvas um, itself. So that will be interesting too. Looking forward to having a try and being able to feed back to you on what I think. So, that's that pack of diamonds. Let's open up the next pack. In this pack, they are smaller little baggies, but um, we've got lots of lovely colors in here too. <gasps> really pretty. And you know what I'm excited about finding. <laughs> Look, we've got, ooh, there's one, there's one. We want to see where these ABs sit on the picture as well, don't we? Ooh, lovely. Let's have a closer look at the ABs. Here they are, so we have got a turquoise colour AB, we have got an orange, a yellow, very delicate yellow, another orange, like a darker orange, a purple, a pink, a green and a white. Really pretty, pretty, pretty. So let's find out. Okay, so looking at the canvas, this circle here is in the feathers. The, so that's the purpley colour, is in the feathers. Then we've got the pink colour in this feather here. We've got green, and this is in the peacock feather as well as her earrings. 
we have got the orange, the darker orange, and that is in this feather up here. We've got an equal sign, and that is in her eyes. An arrow up, which is this delicate yellow, and this delicate yellow goes all the way around the sunshine. So around the edge of the sun, we've got the turquoise blue, which is depicted in the beads and also her earrings. And then the white, which is in the highlights of her eyes, her lips, picking out those little gleams Oh, that's going to be so pretty with the painting and then these ABs picked out in the feathers, her eyes, her lips, just those little touches here and there. It's just going to bring it alive. And so many gorgeous colours of ABs in this one. Really, really gorgeous. Carrot Dot Art have a website. They ship from Germany and their website is really lovely to look at. They have artwork that you won't have seen before because they do have exclusive licensed art. This is one of those. So if you would like to go and have a look and if you decide to purchase, do use the code STONEMAGPIE10 and claim 10% discount. And you can do that for any purchase, not just your first. What a fabulous kit. I am really pleased with it. Just look at everything here with those gorgeous colours of diamonds and the cutout stickers, the washi tape and the image itself. I am so pleased and I can't wait to feedback about how close the grid is for the square diamonds on this one. I will be working on it and I hope that you can join me as well to see the progression of this diamond painting. Of course, in the meantime, please do like, share and subscribe and enjoy your own diamond painting. <laughs> Take care, everyone. Bye.